Hi kiddos and welcome once again to the Mr. Duncan Show. Today I'm going to help you with a problem all of you seem to be having. You see my audience in the background. There's Dylan, there's Tommy. Smile Dylan, smile Tommy. Thank you. There you go. See, so they helped me out with the video today. But we're going to talk about your travel journal and how to insert an image and put it where you want to go and make it look really cool, right? Because the opposite of cool is not cool and you don't want your brochure to be not cool so let's do this so here you have I see my I have my travel sh brochure set up and I've got my must be the lay man it's messing me up um, it's got my slogan and it's got my brochure title and now I just want to put an image in there and get it all wrapped and and put what put it put it nicely you know arrange it the way I want to so the first thing I need to do is, of course, select an image. So I'm going to go to Insert, Image, and I'm going to search the web. And I'm going to search for Island. How about that? How about that? I'm going to search for an island. Oh, and there we go. And I, even though I look, I spelled it wrong, but I still got an island. So let's do this island because that looks like a good place to go. I'm going to insert that, and it's going to go right where my cursor is. No, but, you know, I don't really like this. So here, let me get this out of the way for a second. I'm going to try to move this, but oh, it won't move. Okay, so I can either wrap text, which means it'll put the uh, text around the image if there's room, or break text, which means it'll break the text above and below the image, okay? So I'm going to wrap the text because I like that. It, oh, no, look what happened. It disappeared. This is a common problem that's not a problem, okay? It's really easy to fix. The way you fix it is you grab this and you move it where you can adjust the size a little bit, right? And once you adjust the size, you can fit it right within the column of your table. And look, now I can move it around. And as I move it around, it wants to make adjustments to my text, right? So I'll move it here. I can move it down here. Uh oh, I think part of my text disappeared. What happened? Okay, I'll move it back up here. And then I get everything back where I want it. So that's it. Don't panic. When you click wrap text because you want to move things around. Oh, that looks much better. Um, make sure that you um, don't panic. Move it out where you can grab it resize it and then move it in and as long as it fits within the column it won't disappear so that's it and thanks a lot for coming to the Mr. Duncan show and we'll see you next time good luck on that midterm kiddos bye